Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Sonic 3 and Knuckles, where we last left off, we completed the obnoxiously long Sandopolis zone, and now we are in the, uh, very awesome Lava Reef zone. I actually forgot about this level when I was talking about my favorite levels in this game. This is definitely not my top three, however, this is my fourth favorite level. Though, number four doesn't really matter, does it? It is a really cool level, though. I, uh had a lot of fun every time I did this level, just because of all the fire, and I've always loved playing with the uh, fire power-up in this level. It's, it makes you virtually immune to all the fire and all the lava, so it's very fun to play around in all the lava, because you can actually walk on the lava. You can go in these lava pools here, and the lava will not hurt you. It's very cool. Ah, uh, there we go the lava power- the uh, fire power up. Hopefully I don't lose it before I can uh, show it off. Going down. I love this effect too. The uh, bike there. They actually can't hurt you here either I believe, yeah. Normally that thing would explode and it would hurt you. But yeah, as you can see guys, we can actually go through this lava here. It's kinda cool. It won't hurt you. Oh, that thing. You can actually uh, get a 1-up right up here if you uh, go fast enough. Oop. And another bike going up. Uh, the uh, fire power-up is very useful in this level. Almost all of the attacks that uh, enemies have outside of spikes and whatnot can't hurt you, which is kind of cool. It makes you, you know, kind of invincible, but not completely, because there are so many spikes like that Wrecking Ball and a whole bunch of other things that just want to kill you. Oh, just like that. Uh, okay, I am back, guys. I have failed epically, and I lost my Fire Shield and all my rings on the way here, but uh, I'm here, so that's all that matters. I believe there is something nice up here. I think there is a secret ring somewhere nearby, but I do not remember how to get it without Tails, so we probably won't be able to do it. Because there is actually a secret ring up top, above this room here. Or it actually might be below. Yep, there it is. I can see it from, down, from over here. I don't know if you guys can see it. Yep, there it is. I do not remember how to get it without Tails. Because I used to fly up to it. But let's see if we can figure it out. Hmm. Yeah, it's right above this room. Right there. We can't get it without tails. That's kind of lame. Oh well. We only need, like, two more anyway, so it's not a big deal. Ah, yes, we got our fire power up back. Great, because I like it so much more in this level. You can just demolish through things. Ooh, big spikes. Be careful of those, they're very dangerous. And actually, this one comes down to get you. Ah! Indiana Jones reference. I guess, anyway. That's what it seems like to me. Uh. Ow. Fire bad. Fire bad. Ow. There we go. <laughs> Luckily for Sonic, he doesn't actually have health, so he can just, you know, glitch through those all he wants. Actually, let's go this way. Let's take the bike. Ow. Oh, good rings. I was about to die there. Taking the upper path is always more fun, so why not? Ah, stupid cloud. I don't know why those things are in this level. They're so out of place. 
Well, I guess Steam is kind of in place in a fire level, but I don't know. These levels are getting long, but I think we're at the end here, so uh, it shouldn't be as long as the uh, other one. Oh, this boss isn't too bad. Pretty much you gotta kill the two sides. Well, yeah, just like that. And then you got a hand, which tries to grab you. When the hand stops moving is when you uh, move aside. Don't bother trying to move when the hand is not mo is moving, because it still will hit you no matter what you do. Just wait, stay still, once you see the hand stops moving, move to the side, or jump, or fail like I just did. Once the uh, sperm looking things are gone, it will only be the hand trying to attack you, and then you can start taking the hand out. Pretty much just stand, jump when it stops moving, actually hit it, unlike what I just did. And up. There we go. Should just be a couple more hits and then I'll be down. Oof. Oh, thank you, Tails. You are a good sidekick, Tails. Oh, hey. Let's save that for the next act. Okay, we have completed Act 1. Not too bad. One death, but still not too bad. Okay, and now that we have defeated the boss, the lava has frozen over, and we are now in a much cooler, though still ridden with fire, part of this level. I always get hit. I'm so bad at this game. Okay. I know of another secret ring somewhere in here, but I'm probably not going to get it, because I do not remember exactly where it is. I'm not very good at this uh, ring collecting, but I really shouldn't be, because it's not good to have it so early in the uh, level when you shouldn't need it, because then you're just cheating at that point. Oof. Let's not do that again. Actually, yeah, let's not go up there, because I don't feel like dying. As you can see, I'm not fit to go anywhere near spikes. This is a cool area. This is actually very reminiscent to uh, Mega Man X. I did a couple of, uh, like in the uh, Storm Eagle stage, they had something similar to that. I just went back down like an idiot. Okay, going back up. Let's try this way this time, instead of going back down like an idiot. Ugh, I fell. Go this way! Oh, dang it. There we go. Ugh, more of these spike balls. Ow! I'm such an idiot. I knew that was going to happen, and I did it anyway. Let's not die, please. Ah. There we go. What's in here? Oh. Death. That's, an o that's always good. I want that fire power up. Give it. There we go. Okay. We can go left or we can go right. No, we can't go left, so let's go right. <laughs> Ow. Bastards. If those cloud things stay on you, they'll actually start draining your coins as opposed to damaging you like you would think they would. I hate these things. It's like a ricochet effect. Oh yes! There is a secret room here. 
I believe there's a secret room on the, the right, too, that'll actually have a s secret ring in it. Yep. There it is. Now let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Two left. Let's do this one. I guess I could do that, too. Ooh! Oh, well. That was bound to happen. But, uh, let's continue. The utter failure. We'll probably stay in the recording, so, uh, oh well. But yeah, let's, uh, continue on. We only need two more. I'll probably get them in a, uh, bonus, or an extra episode before we do the, uh, very last level, because we do, like I said, we do need the, uh, Super Emeralds to complete this game, because there is a special level that requires all of them to be in our possession. I won't explain why for, uh, spoiler reasons, but, you know. Ugh, spikes everywhere, I hate them. Ow. Frickin' fire. Ooh, I think we're reaching the end of the level now. Awesome. Woo! That was close. I almost got knocked off because of the frickin' fire. Okay. Another one of these upside-down jumping things. Ooh! That is utter skill right there. Ignoring the fact that I fell to uh, do that skill. <laughs> More spike balls, I hate them. Okay. Here we are, we're actually at the... Uh, end boss here now. Or kind of end boss. As you can hear, it's Knuckles. You bastard! Uah! Still being a dick to us, I swear. Is that the death egg? Oh god! You bastard! But yes, you actually can't attack this thing it is more of a uh, running thing than a boss. I believe there is a boss on the way out before the ending, but uh, this is like a boss before a boss. They're getting really intense now at the end of these levels. Whew. Just uh, be careful and just follow the way and don't go too far down, otherwise you will probably take a lot of damage. I want this one. There we go. Now you can go all the way down. Pretty much uh, what you can do is stand on one of these and wait for it to reach the bottom. If it stops going down, you did it right, and there will actually be a uh, mini boss. If you have the fire shield, you can jump anywhere. Pretty much all you need to do is let his bombs hit him so he can kill himself like an idiot. It's very easy with the fire shield, because you could just stand on the lava. Normally, you would have to stand on the little uh, icebergs, I guess they would be. So I'll be trying to do that, but, you know, for easy sake, I don't really have to. Whew. Not a big deal. I think we will need one more time, and he will be dead. Why aren't you dead? Oh, Robonic, you're killing me here. I might have to put this video into another uh, part, if you continue this. Die! Aha! There we go. Alright. We have completed Act 2 with little casualty, but uh, went on pretty long. Hopefully I can fit this into one episode. If not, I will just cut it into the uh, next level. But uh, I will see you guys in the next episode where we do Hidden Palace Zone. See you later.